Open up your Unity software and create a new project. Rename it as My First Game and click the Create Project button. You will see a white canvas. In the Hierarchy tab, press 3D Object and use a plane. From the project tab, you can use materials and rename it as green. Choose the color green from the color selector and simply drag and drop the green material on the plane. Again, create a 3D object cube which will be your main player. Rename it as player. Scale it down to 0.5 along x, y and z axis. Simply reposition it to your desired place. Add a component known as rigid body, which will give simple and basic physics to this object, like gravity and mass. I am now repositioning the scene so I can use the scene better. Create a material for your player. I would like to choose yellow. Select the yellow color from the color mixer and again drag and drop that material on your main player. Highlight the player and add another component. This time you will be adding a new script. Rename your script as player movement and hit create and add. Double click on your new script. So, a new software will be opened known as MonoDevelop, in which you are able to edit your script. Remove the start function as you do not require it. In the update function, you will use if statements. If input.get key, key code w. Transform dot position is equal to transform dot position plus transform dot forward multiply by move speed. We have to declare the move speed variable. I'm going to declare it as a public. So public float move speed and I'm going to assign it a value of 0 0.3 copy your if statement and paste it right below it Replace W with S and addition with subtraction. Save the program and return to your Unity 3D. As you can see that our camera is not on the focus. So highlight the camera and press Shift, Control and F. Then again press the play button. Upon pressing W and S, you can see that our player can move and it also falls, proving it has gravity. It's time to add some rotation. Again, I'm going to use if statements. If input dot get key key code A Transform dot rotate along the y axis.
you will have to remember that for a the y-axis should be negative and for the key code D, the y-axis should be positive. Save this program and again go to your Unity 3D software. Change your speed to 0.1 float so that you can control the player more efficiently and more easily. Save it again and go to your Unity program again. Hit the play button and check for the results. As you can see that it is more controllable and now you have its acceleration plus rotation. Some bonus info. What if you want to add the camera along your player? Just simply reposition your camera and put it in the player. Again, Now save your scene by pressing Ctrl plus S. I will save my scene as first player movement. And click the save button.